Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Frank Malarsic and in this video, we're going to be talking once again about Helium cryptocurrency and how my mining has been going. I've definitely uh, been doing a lot since the last video I made on this uh, about two months ago. I actually invested a fair bit of money in this, which we're going to look at uh at the towards the end of the video uh, but for right now we're just going to look at my different miners and how they've been performing so this one we're showing here i'm going to have like all the private details blurred out uh, just for privacy as you can see it's sort of in the cincinnati area i just zoomed out so you couldn't really see the exact location uh, but this one is uh been earning around 0 0.2 helium uh, per day and you can see over the last 30 days, it's earned around 1.7. Um, but I just uh, got it back connected um, around the beginning of December. And this one is actually owned by Emirate, which I did talk about in the last video. And that means that basically I only get 20% of the earnings from this one. Uh, so that's fine. It's been performing fairly well. Um, but I don't think I'm going to get uh, much from this one anytime soon just because of some things where they've actually like overpaid me um, the past few months. So probably won't get much in the coming months, but we'll see how this one goes in the future. The next one is one I'm really excited about. This one is also in the Cincinnati area, but this is one that I bought myself and um, I actually just bought it from some lady on Discord. It sounds a little sketchy, but um, luckily it was perfectly fine. Everything worked out. And actually, I paid about $500 for this one. I think around $560 actually, uh, which for a Bobcat, which is the brand that this one is, is pretty close to retail value. Uh, plus, you know, whatever shipping. Uh, so I'm pretty happy with that because a lot of times if you are going to, you know, buy it from a private seller and receive it fairly quickly, you're going to pay, pay a very high premium on the actual retail price. So I thought 560 was a fantastic deal. And as you can see, this one's been earning around 0 0.3 uh, H&T per day. And uh, over the last 30 days, it's earned about nine helium, uh, which is pretty awesome. I've had this one up and running since um, sometime the beginning of November, I think maybe around November 7th or 8th. So it's been going just about a month and we're making about so far about nine helium per month, which is super awesome to see. And then the last one here I have uh, is one that I got pretty recently. Uh, this one is actually sort of in the Cleveland area and uh, over the last 30 days, you can see it's only earned 0 0.2, but I just got it hooked up, you know, just a few days ago. And this one I actually bought from a company called MNTD. And basically what they do instead of, you know, having you order, uh, the miner and then, you know, sometime receive it months and months later, uh, what they do is they basically have, you know, drops sort of like some merch companies have where they basically have, you know, stockpile a bunch of them. And then on a certain date, they'll sell a bunch of them all at once. And, um, there's the good part of that, which means you get it fairly quickly, but on the downside, sometimes it may be hard to uh, get one if uh, you don't get into the website quick enough and some other people basically buy them all up before you can get your hands on one. Uh, but now we're going to go to this website called Helium Hiker, and it basically uh, aggregates and shows how much uh, your hotspot is earning each month. So we're just going to look at November, and for this hotspot, uh, this one's the one that's owned by Emirates, so I really only get 20%. Um, this one, since it was offline a lot of November, I only earned around 3.6 HNT. Um, so, I'll, you know, 20% of that is less than one. And um, I haven't received any of that. And I think that's just because um, I have been paid extra in the past um, for, you know, amounts I've earned. Uh, so that's all right with me. I'll keep it, you know, up and running. And hopefully at some point in the future, I'll have, you know, basically been paid the amount I've been paid and the amount I earned and should have been paid will be about equal and then I'll start getting paid again. Um, but this next one here is the one, the Bobcat that I started in November. It earned around 5.8 HNT in November and so far, uh, less than two weeks into December, it's already earned four helium. So that's super exciting. And um, this one has actually been doing pretty good for me. And then the last one here, obviously, uh, this new one that I just got up and running a few days ago, only earned around 0.22 HNT, but that's fine. Um, I think 
uh, it's been doing pretty well um, around 0.2 per day uh, so I hope that we can get you know maybe five or ten over the course of the month that would be ideal um, and now going into my spreadsheet I want to talk a little bit about all the numbers um, so this right here is how much um, I've gotten paid by Emirates on the left side here which is basically a total of around 20 helium um, and that has been worth you know around seven hundred fifty dollars um, right here basically at seven hundred sixty nine dollars is what I have earned from that one um, and then this right here is you know what I've been keeping track of for my miners that I personally bought so basically in the month of November I earned around 5.77 HNT and right now my general strategy is I'm going to sell most of the earnings I make for USD um, and just until I can break even on my investments basically into uh, these miners and then once I break even then I'll start um, probably just stockpiling HNT and in the future hopefully I can sell it for more than it's worth now if the price continues to go up uh, so that's the plan with that um, but I actually haven't sold any of this that I earned in the month of November quite yet because uh, you know the price of most cryptos including helium has actually dropped pretty drastically over the past few weeks so I'm just sort of waiting for it to recover a little bit and then I'll probably sell that for maybe around $200 and then over here on the right, I want to talk about the different miners that I bought. So right here, I bought a miner actually from the official Bobcat like website um, straight from the company. And that was about $525. I have not received that one yet. It's probably going to be, you know, a few months still probably out into March or April before I get that one. Uh, that's just how that goes. And then a few days later is when I bought that other Bobcat miner from the lady on Discord. And that's the one that has been earning, uh, that earned most of this 5.77 here for me. And then I also bought, I actually bought two of the miners from MNTD um, for around $820, which is about 410 per miner. And then I actually sold one of them to uh, someone I know on Discord, um, and I got about $450 from that. And then he, uh, the shipping cost is around $30. So I made about $420 on that. So really I kind of profited about $10 just from buying the miner and then reselling it to him. So that means right down here, my total miner expenses um, for buying miners is around right around $1,500. And as we can see, my profits so far in US dollars is around $769. Uh, or my earnings, I guess. So that means my total profits is around negative $710. Um, and the uh, amount of HNT I have in my wallet right now is around four. So that gives it a value of around $118. And if we add in this 5.77, um, just round up to 10, if we add that in, that gives us a value of around $300. So we have around $300 of helium just kind of sitting there. So in that case, you know, we're only in the hole around $400. Uh, so over time, I think probably by you know the end of January or February, I'm hoping to be breaking even, um, and at that point, it'll all just be profits. Uh, I am for one of the miners I do have in Cincinnati. Uh, it's at basically a friend's uh, apartment, so I am paying them you know around 20% for uh, having that at their apartment. So I will have some more expenses there once I actually pay that to them. But overall, uh, I'm super happy with how this is going for me. Uh, so far, most of my miners have been performing pretty well. Just you know, comparing them to others in the areas and some other people I know uh, throughout the U.S. and Canada that do have some miners as well. Um, I think mine are doing pretty well uh, compared to a lot in the, the network. So. I'm pretty excited about this venture. It's uh, something a little bit different uh, than what I normally talk about on this channel, but uh, it is you know something I'm investing in, and uh, so that's why I wanted to share it with you guys and uh, see what you guys thought. So if you guys do have any experience with this type of mining cryptocurrency, would definitely love to hear uh, your thoughts down in the comments below. And wanted to thank you guys for sticking around to the end of the video. I will see you in the next one.